physical maps as in previous topic we discussed that in case of genetic linkage mapping the exact location of the genes uh, it cannot be uh, pointed out but on the other hand this is not the situation uh, for physical maps because it can pinpoint the physical location of the genes and as well as the genetic uh, basis uh, distances between the different landmark so on the basis of uh, the number of nucleotides it can pinpoint that how one uh, genetic marker it is separated from another so uh, physical mapping may not only we can find out the location of genes uh, but in terms of number of uh, nucleotide bases हम ये कह सकते हैं कि एक लैंडमार्क जो है या एक जेनेटिक मार्कर जो है वो दूसरे जेनेटिक मार्कर से इतने बेस पेयर सेपरेटेड है सो व्हेन अगेन वी विल कंपेयर दिस टू टाइप ऑफ मैप्स सो इन केस ऑफ जेनेटिक लिंकेज मैपिंग द एग्जैक्ट पोजीशन और एक्चुअल पोजीशन इट कैन नॉट बी एलुसिडेटेड द रीजन इज दैट the pattern of inheritance that uh, due to variation in the recombination frequency the exact position cannot be pinpointed ke jo recombination ki frequency hai wo ek jo genome ka part hai wo different tarike se recombine karta hai as compared to other part so because of this reason the exact position cannot be pointed out another reason uh, was that uh, in case of uh, uh, genetic linkage maps basically the traits were studied and uh, genes were not considered now in case of modern maps like the physical maps now the genes uh, now the traits are characterized in terms of genes that help to designate uh, the position of particular genes no different type of uh, mapping techniques are available and here in case of physical maps any clone within the genomic library it can act as a starting point for example if we uh, want to map a certain uh, genomic dna then it can be digested then it can be recombined in the vector molecule like uh, Uh, plasmid bacteriophages uh, m13 vector cosmids plasmids so they can act as vector so we can develop the genomic library we can pick any clone we can sequence it and then we can uh, find the position of other genes and if we have some longer length of the target segments or the restriction fragment then it is more helpful like uh, now we have bacterial artificial chromosome that can minimize the number of fragments that are generated due to partial digestion so that more than 100 kilobase fragments they can also be cloned although some other vectors like the yeast artificial chromosomes are also available that can clone larger dna fragments but uh, they can introduce certain addition deletions uh, during the process of replication so they may not be so much suitable but uh, overall we can say that certain uh, clones they can act as a starting point to construct physical maps and later on we will also uh, study that uh, uh, some other uh, characteristic feature like the polymorphic sequences within the genome and that form the basis of the study of restriction fragment length polymorphism uh, it can also be used to construct uh, physical maps so a variety of methods can be uh, used to study the physical maps and you should be aware that in coming lectures mainly we are going to focus on the physical maps and before uh, going to onward one should uh, know the difference that uh, 
uh, what are the genetic linkage map and uh, what are the uh, physical maps.